been a grave miscarriage of justice and an abuse of power perpetrated by my predecessor, Andrew Thomas, and the Maricopa County Sheriff's Office, which continues to this day. As many of you know, the Maricopa County Sheriff's Office has publicly and repeatedly announced allegations of criminal misconduct against judges, members of the Board of Supervisors, senior county officials, and private citizens. I am standing here before you to tell you the rest of the story and to clear the names of those individuals whose reputations have been dragged through the mud. I petitioned the court to allow me to release the grand jury material relating to the court tower and the bug sweep investigations. On August 5th, the petition was granted by the court with a direction to me to disclose and make public grand jury materials in the furtherance of justice and without undue delay. The filing for a petition to unseal grand jury transcripts, that by itself is extraordinarily rare and even more rare that it's ever granted. The conduct of the Maricopa County Sheriff's Office and the former county attorney was not to seek justice, but was to persecute those who dared oppose them. I have forwarded this material to the United States Attorney and the FBI for their consideration in their ongoing investigations into the Maricopa County Sheriff's Office and the Maricopa County Attorney's Office regarding abuse of power. There may be some who say this is just Romley's way of getting back at our files. You'll remember back on April 16th when I agreed to take back the position of county attorney. I made a promise, and that promise was to restore the trust and the integrity of this office. I believe in that. Mm -hmm.